I'm back with one of my other loom tutorials and today I'm going to show you uh, how to make the dragon scale cuff bracelet and uh, it looks like this. This is the six pin. Yeah, this is the six pin cuff bracelet and I'm also going to be showing you the tenth pin dragon scale cuff bracelet. And it's really cool. I really love it. And they're actually a bit big for me, but I hope right now I make my size. So yeah, I'm going to be showing you how to make these two. And uh, there's also a two peg, no, a four peg bracelet, but I'm only going to be showing you these. Okay, so let's get started. So we're going to do the six peg one. So it's going to be this one. And I'm going to start with my first color. So we're going to use these two, these two, or these two. Okay, so first let me start by making a infinity sign, which looks like this. And then getting another of my first, of my color. You could use different colors if you don't care. Like that. Then get another one, the last one, and do all that. So we're going to be skipping these right there. So I should look like this, gold, gold, gold. Now we're going to push this down. Sorry about all the noise with this thing. Okay, and now we're going to get the next, the next color. Make another infinity sign, so let me show you. Like this in the middle, and all that. And then we're going to do the exact same thing with this side, like that. Now we're going to start cooking. Okay, we're going to get this gold, pull it up, and this should have a little twisty thing, so we're going to get it, and then twist it like that. So put it back, twist it. Okay, and then we're going to get the gold one over here. Over here. Over here. And like that. So then push that down. Okay. So it should look like this. Gold and gold blue. Okay. And then we're going to get gold again and this time we're not going to to make a infinity sign so do it like that and then do the exact same thing with this one right here and this one over here then we want to hook so get this bottom one hook it up and then also this blue one and hook it up and then this one. So, like, we just need to hook these right here in the bottom. It might be confusing for a little second. Like that. Okay. So, we're going to push that down. And we want to be repeating the step. So, let me just show you one more time. So then I'm getting my blue. Well, I'm doing more, two more times. Okay, so we're going to be skipping this part and going these right here. Once I put this color right there, so then it goes straight. And then do the exact same thing over here. So we, you should just put two. Like this. And then hug the gold. Maybe a little bit confusing here. I'm going to get this one right there. Hold it. Okay. And do that again. Do that again. Oops, we got stuck. And then get this one. And it should look like that. So let me show you one more time. Okay. So it should be coming a little bit out right there. So now let's move to the gold. So 
sorry about that, but you heard it. Okay, so then we have to go back over here. So start with this. Got another one. And another one. So I'll mix three. And then just pull this the gold one as we did right now. Pull the blue. Pull it. Sometimes it gets a little bit stuck right here and frustrating. But you have to be patient with this. I think it's like a good idea to make it with a little kind of episode or shows in the TV. So, it should be coming up right there. So then you just have to be repeating the steps to get the blue. And instead of putting over here, over here. So it's like if, if they're taking a bit of turns. Like that. Like that. So I'm just going to skip until I'm done. So Sometimes it's pretty it's pretty long, so don't get confused with that. Let me just pull these, that, and ugh, sometimes I get really frustrated like that. Okay, just just re keep on repeating the step like that, and remember then we go like that, and then like that, and then like that. So if you get it, thumbs up. If you don't, then just comment what you didn't get. Okay, so uh, let me just come back when I So when you have enough, I have this, like that. I'm, you should have right here like this. Uh, you could actually have like two right there, but yeah, okay. So we're going to get this right here from the side. Just the camera look. Okay. Okay. So we're we're going to get this right here, pull it out of there, and then hook it right here to the next one. And then do the exact same thing over here. And then get this bottom and hook it over here. And then also to the other side. And we should have these three whichever three you could have so like that and now we're going to get our C clips or S clips in my right here make you kind of think so I went to Disney World and I got this so right here I have my S clip and I'm gonna get three so right here I have three okay sorry about that Okay, and we're going to hook one right here. So if you want to make it easier to hook it, just put it over there. Just hook it right here. Okay. Okay, I'm having a little bit of difficulty with this. Let me, let me just, oh my gosh. Have that just that up right there. Right here, I'm gonna put this one over here and hook it. Oh my gosh, I'm having some difficulties with this, so sorry about that. Oops. Okay, now take that out. Now, let's put the middle one. Let me just pull it. Okay, now. Unhook the bracelet, and this should actually look kind of little, but this one stretches like a lot, literally. So this is, this is like perfect for this. Oops, sorry. With that, so now I'm going to hook it over here. So just get whichever part. So right there, hook that part right there. I'm getting another one in the middle. Like that. So, but now it should look like this. 
So you have hooked two of them. I just need one more. So I'm gonna get this one, this one over here. Then just hook the S button. There. Okay. So it should look like this now. This is the back. Let me just stretch it a bit. This is the back. Okay, I'm now try it on. Try it on. So it doesn't really show now. Okay, there we go. So it should look like this. It's really cute. So now I'm going to be showing you how to make the tenth pin. The tenth pin one. And it's literally really Okay, so this is how it turned out. And it turned out really good. It actually looks like this one over here that I made earlier. And it doesn't take that long. You just have to be a bit patient. But when you get the hang of this, it's really easy to make. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.